There's no harm in the windows. So what do you do? Yeah, I can get it. It's STEM day today and a bunch of kids from other schools have brought projects here to show us and I'm thankful that they did that because they, they're using their time to come to us. Today our phys ed students from GSMST are visiting the 4th and 5th graders at Benefield to showcase their projects that they've done throughout the year for Georgia STEM Day. At Benefield, me and a group of my colleagues, we're here presenting these different projects that we've done over the span of the year in our physics and engineering class. And we're teaching them different AKSs for optics, circuits, using the different types of games and houses, whatever we've built. So really we're here just to kind of teach these fourth graders what we've learned. And they're really amazing what they did. Like um, one project I saw, was this kid, he had um, a, la he was doing this laser thing where he would reflect it off mirrors and then you had like an object and you had to hit a part but it was in the back. That was really fun and you had to use a little logic to be smart with it, you know. I hope that it ignites a fire in them for STEM, for STEM related occupations, um, for the technology piece even involved in this so that, that as they go forward that they'll remember this and, and it'll be in their minds as they go to high school, as they go on to college, that this may be something that they from today's experience may want to do as a career later. So that's what I'm hoping. You should see the interaction between the students. They are. They are building relationships, they are talking about science, and they are getting excited. Oh, dang! This is awesome! The teachers are constantly talking to the kids about how this applies to the daily life and what they can do in the future with this information. So I think it builds that nice connection of the importance of learning it now and the application when they get to high school and into the future. So the other part is I hope that we develop a collaboration, an adult collaborative relationship as well as a student collaboration and then we have some vertical alignment. Engineering and math.